The annual show and shine event brought thousands to Fort George Park Sunday to see the hundreds of vehicles. The cars and trucks on display came with their own special story. They came big and small, new and old, and they were everywhere. One man's prized show cars have been in Prince George for decades, whereas another was making its debut at the show and shine. Blue Thunder started its life out as a run-of-the-mill 1979 Ford F-150 in Missouri. It was recently imported to Prince George, but nearly didn't make it. In fact, the day that they picked the truck up to leave here was the day the tornado touched down, and the, the truck left on Monday morning, and the storm touched down Monday afternoon, so the truck was lucky to get out of there alive. The states of Oklahoma and Missouri were hit by tornadoes last month. One went through the area where the truck was being stored. 1997 is when he started building it into a show truck. and He got ideas from Bob Chandler, the original creator of Bigfoot, because they were friends, and he went on a tour of the Bigfoot garage and got his ideas. But when the original owner, Ben Pratt's wife died, he decided to sell Blue Thunder. The deal was finalized last summer, but Pratt died in an accident, halting the deal. In the spring they phoned and said that uh, the estate had been settled and the family had talked it over and they knew that their dad was a car guy and we were car guys and that their dad wanted us to have the truck even though the Ford dealer down there wanted to buy it. Blue Thunder carries the memories of Ben Pratt and his wife and through new owners the stories continue. Much like that of Peter Kramer's Datsuns. He's owned the 1966 Orange Roadster since he was 15 in 1975. My uh, father bought me two of them and he said there's uh, the two make one. It took me two years the first time, this time it's four years and going. The Roadster was Kramer's first car and first love, but his love of his Datsun didn't stop with just the one. So I got this one and then I got uh, the 260, I got it and I neglected this one because I had the 260. And then somebody told me, well, there's a, there's a roadster behind my place, so then I bought the yellow one. Between Peter Kramer and his Datsuns and Dennis Townsend and the Blue Thunder, the stories behind the cars continue beyond the carpet and the paint. Zamir Karim, CKPG News.